Happy Friday, folks. I'm going to come and share with you some Valentine entries for Operation Valentine's and some packaged things that have been donated for this particular program. And I have exciting news also. Uh, I spoke to uh, the Child Life Specialist at Dornbeckers, and last year they approved my program. This year they are endorsing it. And on the day of delivery, I will have two gals with me that um, have been helping me through this organizing and, and just been helping me so much through, uh, you know, all of the entries and things of that nature that are going to come and join me this year. And upon arrival, we will be getting an interview from their marketing director and it will be um, on a news channel. So I'm really excited about this. It's just two steps closer to being able to accommodate the 70% of children's hospitals in the U.S. that do not have a Valentine program. So yay, Operation Valentine's. Um, but I'm going to accumulate into two videos as fast as I can. Again, I am sorry if they're really long, but uh, I want to do at least 10 to 11 packages of videos. So Kat Carbone, who is Lolly Thimble, my sweet dear friend, she uh, heard me say that we needed 12 by 12 card stock for the kids' bags, which we do. Um, and anything that's, just so you know, folks, if you guys do donate paper, that's great. Um, we will save it for next year as well because this is a program I, I do every year. So these bags are amazing, and the more hospitals we have, the more bags we need to make. And 12 by 12 paper in Valentine theme, boy and girl, is actually very difficult to find um, unless you want to spend a gazillion dollars. So uh, Kat was so sweet and sent some pictures, I mean sent some uh, paper. And then, of course, she, I have already kind of pre-opened this because I wanted a sneak peek, but... She sent me some kitty paper for me and a cool die cut, which I'm really excited about, and some kitty goodies. So, of course, that goes in my little Lancelot pile uh, for my junk journals that I'm going to be making for my, my child, my fur child. Um, she gifted some paper, and it's a lot, and I'm not going to go through all of it. I mean, Star Wars pad. I did open this. I actually, um, it's a whole kit, but I think we're going to actually make boy valentines out of this just because I don't want to waste a whole sheet of paper on a bag on those. I think it'd be super cute. Just super cute paper, Valentine paper, girl and boy. So thank you so very much, Kat. And there's a bunch of doily packages, and that's awesome. All better for the kids. We need as many bags as possible. Uh, and then with her, she, she marked them one through three. She's so cute. Um, she gifted these. And this is for the bag closures. So a lot of this is thin, but I got it all for free. She's so sweet. Look at all this. Perfect for the bags. So, oh my gosh, Kat, this is awesome. Thank you so very much. And then in here is a big bag of embellishment goodies for all the kids' Valentine's craft station. So look at all this. I won't open it all up, but Kat, you are a doll. Thank you so very much. Kids are going to love this. This is awesome. Now, that was her other box. There is three. <laughs> so, <coughs> here is the third box. Actually, it's marked number one. And these are for me, so I will look at those separate. But look, she got me a... Look at this tie toy. It says, Vintage T.Y. Kitty from, a lo from my local shop. Oh my gosh, I feel like I need to open this and show you guys. And of course, I have to hide it from my, my fur child. Oh my gosh, it is. It's a vintage kitty. Look how cute. Oh, and the arms and the legs move. This is so cute, cat. Okay, I have to put it back in the bag and hide it. So my fur monster does not uh, eat it, you know, because he would. Um, and cat, thank you. She sent Valentine's in boxes. So thank you so very much. This is so appreciated. Um, the kids are just going to love this. I'm, I'm really... So excited um, to share with you all the entries today. This next entry comes from, hold on, let me find her, Lisa Nickel. And she sent a really cute little box. And in this box are, look at this, the little fun mazes for the kids, some sticker embellishments. Oh my gosh, how cute! Oh my gosh, this is just full. A box set of paper airplane cards. Oh my gosh, this is perfect. I have not seen those, so I was just making them. Good call. Ooh, some fun washi for one of the craft cards. Look at all these fun little stickers and some brads. Oh, these are fun. Oh, these are fun. They're all Valentine rub-ons. How cute. How cute and fun. And look at all these, you guys. 
Look at all this. Oh, this is so awesome. Thank you so much. And yes, letters, uh, sticker letters are always fun too because the kids that can't write or they have limited supplies on writing things, they can do those for their names on their bags. So super fun. And also is her cards, which are so stinking cute, you guys. And she put them in their own little sleeves. Oh my gosh, look at that. Valentine, you're my kind of quirky. This is cute. Oh my gosh, Lisa, these are adorable. Oh, I love that. Pretty, pretty. Oh, such great cards. I'm hog wild for you. This is so stinking cute. I love the envelopes too. Thank you. And this is one of those pull cards. Oh, these are so sweet, Lisa. Thank you so very much. I'm excited. Okay, well, let's organize by which ones I'm showing because I have so many today. Next up will be from Julie Crabbenhort. And she sent, oh, she sent me a card. Thank you. She sent a box set of cards. And then here's, oh, that, yes. These are so pretty. I saw the picture she sent to these. Look at this. Look how beautiful these lady images are. That is so pretty. These die cuts are just darling. I love this <laughs> with the weather balloon and the cloud and the heart banner and this one. I just loved the airplane one. Sorry, I had it upside down. Is that not adorable? She inked a stressed up. These fairies are so pretty. I love them. She stamped them with Happy Valentine's Day on the inside. Oh, they're just so beautiful. Thank you so very much, Julie. I love these. I will link her um, <coughs> channel below. She has a YouTube channel. Some of these ladies do and some of these ladies don't. So if it takes me a day or so to get the link up, I'm sorry. I just have so much to go. Uh, this is from Sherry Melish. Melish. And she sent a fun box set of cards as well. And here are her card entries. Let's see if I can't get these open. Oh, look how cute the zebras. Oh my gosh, and the giraffes. These are stamps, aren't they? These are darling. These are just darling. Oh, look at the puppy. These are so cute. Oh, Sherry, these are adorable. And then here's a card for me, so I will open that later. Super sweet. Thank you so much. And see if I can't get them back in the bag. This is how I organize them. I keep them with their original packaging. So I do the video first, so I'm just looking at them the same time you are. The only thing I do is pre-open them. And then I go back there and log and take video and pictures. Or pictures, I should say. Next up is from Kim... Gordon, who is too sweet for BS here on YouTube, whom I just love. She did a video response showing cards. And I'm pretty sure she did not show all of them because look how many there are, folks. Oh, my word, Kim. I saw some of these, but not all of them. Oh, that's beautiful. Beautiful. Look at that embossing. Happy Valentine's Day. I love that. These are gorgeous, Kim. Oh, be my my one true Valentine. These are so stinking cute. Kim is new to card making, but she has now been doing it for a while, and she's just getting good. At, look at uh, this. I like this card. Not going to lie. I love that card. But she's just getting better and better and better, and I think she just has a knack for it. So I will definitely link her channel below. Go check her out. I really enjoy her. This is cute. I really enjoy her as a person and her crafting channel. So definitely check it out. Oh, this is adorable. Does this open? Oh my gosh, it does. This is cute. Oh, Kim. These are amazing. You guys got to see this too. She wrote, she did a cute little face on there. Operation Valentine's. <laughs> She's so cute. Oh, and she gave me a card too. At the end of all of the Operation Valentine's, I have my junk journal for Operation Valentine's and I'm going to do a February daily junk journal review of all the things that were sent to just me. Not that I get a lot, but I do get some. So I want to share that. Oh, that's cute. I love that. These are adorable, Kim. So cute. I love this hedgehog die cut. He's just so funny. Oh, I don't know where you found all these, but they're so cute. I didn't find a lot of the blue stuff. 
You're the bee's knees. I love that ribbon. These are all so pretty, you guys. And again, if you're not a part of the Facebook group, please click the link in my description box to join um, because you can actually see a full-on pictures of all of these entries and little tidbits of things that are happening here and there that I don't share on YouTube. Uh, I do share a lot of it through the Facebook group. It's just a lot easier for me to manage. So look how pretty these are. I love these. Kim, you did a great job. You really did. Thank you so very much. I love this with the old vintage typewriter. Look at the buttons. Oh my goodness, lady. These are darling. Just darling. Darling, darling, darling. Thank you so much, Kim. I appreciate these. The kids are going to love them. All right, we're going to move along. I'm already exhausted. Just say it. <laughs> Next up is going to be from Ellen Day, who I believe she's from Texas. So Ellen Day made a set of these, which are so cute. You're my love bug. Oh my gosh, and then there's, she made quite a bit. There's not just a set of those, there's a set of these cute little um, birdies. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. Oh, these are darling. And then the kitty, oh, they're all different. There's kitties and kitties, and then I saw a puppy one, and then puppies. These are cute. Okay, Ellen, these are adorable. Love, love, love. If I've missed any in the showing of this video, like I said, they will be in the Facebook group. Because I do take them out and actually take pictures of all of them. Just to give inspiration and also to showcase everybody's work twice. I just feel that that's appropriate. Okay, so these are cute. So she has two different kinds of this. You've got, do you need a hug from the cute little porcupine? And then these cute little green ones. Oh my gosh, they're cute. They're little dinosaurs. Rawr. Oh, those are adorable. Oh, Lisa, these are Ellen. I'm sorry. Ellen, these are adorable. Super stinking cute. And then here's the, the larger cards that she made. And these are really pretty. I love the twine. I love the die cut. That's a really pretty die cut. Oh, she made quite a few of those. And then she made, oh my gosh, look at the bears. It says, sending you love. Let me see if I can't just put them in categories. Look at that with the little birdie and the envelope. Oh, these are cute. <laughs> oh, I was trying to open this one up to see what the inside. Oh, it says happy heart day. Perfect stamp too. It says, I love you, a bushel and a peck. And look, it's the birdies. This is really great. These would be great for little boy cards too. What a great card. Love that. Can you guys see that the blue in there? It's really pretty. And then these ones are... She paper pieces and stamped these. Happy Valentine's Day. These are pretty. Beautiful, Ellen. Beautiful. And then she did the same cards, but in different patterned backgrounds. So these are darling, Ellen. Thank you so very much. I'm excited about these. Lots of cards for me to count today, folks. Lots of cards. Next up will be from Heather Seacraft, who also did a YouTube uh, video response as well, which I will also link below. She made cute, cute, cute cards. So I will show them again. Look at this. You occupy my heart. Loving you is so easy to do. This is cute. And then she made these guys. Look how cute these are. Kitty and a puppy. Oh, these are so cute. Then she made these ones with the whale. These are cute. I love this whale. And then she included a set of box cards. So perfect, 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 Heather. Thank you so very much. And again, folks, check out her channel. I will link it below. She's pretty talented. She's been doing a whole Valentine card series, folks. If you're not subscribed to her, please do. Her cards are absolutely darling. Next up will be from Miss Jeannie Louise, who is the Dazzling Duchess here on YouTube, who I will also link below to her channel. One of my dear, sweet friends. And she did not do a video response, but she does have a channel, so I will link that. Uh, the first thing I see is this. <laughs> and she got me this. Look how cute this is. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, kiss me. I'm totally yours. Thanks for being awesome. This is adorable, Jeannie. <laughs> Frog. Oh, my word. That is adorable. Thank you. 
She included quite a few things, folks, for the kids, so this is pretty awesome. So she gave them some pencils, which is awesome for the bags, just great for the bags. Oh my gosh, she found these. I was on a mission for these. I could not find them. This is, will be adorable. We can put some of these in the girls' uh, bags or boys. And look at all these cute embellishments. So these are awesome because she kept them in the packages so I can take these to one of the four craft stations. Oh my gosh, she has two of these. Perfect. The little kids are going to love those. Love all the stickers and embellishments. Pretty awesome. These are all pretty awesome. Oh, she included a little something for me. Oh my goodness, that sweet lady. All these are great. So these are all going to go into the, uh, the craft stations. She included some envelopes, which is awesome. So I will make sure that all the kids' cards get to go into those envelopes. And these, and then she also included these. So a few box sets, folks. The Avengers, Spider-Man, and then these are super <laughs> cute. They come with pencils. Okay, it's the world's cutest dog. And that is the world's cutest dog. They come with 16 Valentines and 16 pencils, and there's two packages of these. So, Jeannie, thank you for finding those. Those are stinking cute. All right, I'm going to put all these away so we can show you her cards. And sorry for the crinkle, folks. I'm opening it up as well. Same as time as you. You're looking at it as, as I am looking at it. I will open up my little goodies from Jeannie later. Just because I want to focus just on the cards today. These are Jeannie's cards. She had to have gotten the same stamp, and I have yet to use mine. I love you like unicorns love rainbows. So cute. Look at these. Oh, my gosh, the smooches. That is adorable, Jeannie. What great paper, too. Oh, look at the puppy. Okay, this is cute. The boy fisherman. Oh, Jeannie. Jeannie, I love this stamp. You have to tell me where you got that stamp. So stinking cute. Great boy cards. Look at that. I like you. These are awesome. Oh, these are great boy cards. Okay, this is so cute. Look at her coloring skills, you guys. Amazing coloring skills. Look at the wiener dog. <laughs> I know there's a, I know the name, oh, there's another one of those. I know the name of this stamp set where they have the funky eyes, but I forget um, who it is. But Jeannie, please tell me again because these are actually way cuter in person than on video because I've actually never seen these stamps in person. So thank you so much, Jeannie. These are adorable and the kids are going to love them. And I can't wait to open my little goodie later. So thank you, Jeannie. You're very sweet. All right, last but not least for this video will be from Kathy Case, who's from North Carolina, and she sent this cute little box set of cards here with a puppy, and these are her cards that she created. That's really pretty. That's like, that's actually cut out. Oh, the Minnie Mouse card. These are cute. Oh, Minnie Mouse paper. Oh, I love it. <laughs> How cute. You know, can never go wrong with Disney, folks. Oh, that's really pretty, too. That lips. These are cute. And pretty Valentine's Day stamp, too. Happy Valentine's Day is a really nice uh, stamp sentiment, and it's hard to find a really pretty one. So, oh, let's see if I can get this. This is direction. Sorry, I've got them upside down. Oh, I love these. Thank you so very much. These are adorable, Kathy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, folks, that's it for this video, and I will be back again with the next video shortly of the next bunch of entries. So, uh, of course, there's my cat, and he's not allowed in here right now, and he knows it, so he is, um, he somehow snuck in. Did you sneak in, big boy? You being naughty? Hey, where's the bug? Where the bug's at? Is there bugs up there? Get them. <laughs> All right, folks, thanks. I'll be back shortly.